hello guys and welcome back to another tutorial on clue 3d and this tutorial i'm going to explain how you can make your pattern float on clue 3d during um simulation and this method works for people that don't use avatar when designing on um, clue 3d maybe you are into bags and so on like that yeah? like what you can see on your screen so before we continue don't forget to click on the subscribe button and also on the notification bell to get more video so now we have our pattern on screen so the next thing i'll do is to simulate to show you what i'm trying to say so let me select my space bar So this is what happens so the pattern falls and get uh, wrinkles you get so there's a way we can make it float on clue 3d so what i'll do is to select my stop the simulation let me just yeah, stop simulation yes and undo all these so next thing i'll do is to select all of them you can select country as, sh as your shortcut to select uh all then what you do is to right click and first um i'm going to freeze i'm coming oh my screen recorder <laughs> so i'm going to freeze this yes so and i'm going to simulate so during simulation that is where we will make these um changes so i'm going to right click here so when i right click i'm going to select um simulation properties so and i'm going to change gravity to zero so i've changed it to zero and um <coughs> i think we are good so let me stop my simulation anyway you can also do this before even um drawing your pattern on screen you get so to prevent this kind of shape so let me select the whole pattern and um, let me unfreeze then let me now simulate so this is what happens it floats you can move it you can see just keep floating just keep floating so this is how you can make your pattern um, float on clue 3d it's even flowing up so when, depending on the way you pull it it just keep floating so but if you depending on the fabric properties and um, how do i put it your fabric and the physical properties of your um of your pattern that will determine the way it's going to um display or move on screen you get so this is just how you can make your pattern um float on clue 3d so thank you for watching this um short tutorial don't forget to click on the subscribe button and also on the notification bell to get more um videos